All right, it's about time I told you guys the truth. What's up you guys, my name is Ryan Thomas Woods and one year ago today, I put on my Facebook that I was in a relationship. And so one year later, my connection with my bae has just grown strong. Strong enough to introduce or at least tell y'all on YouTube about my relationship with my Wi-Fi. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, we have been together for one year, according to Facebook, and all I can say is that my bae is the absolute best. <laughs> my bae is always there for me, 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, and although our love is intertwined among a network of connections within my heart, no relationship is 100% perfect. I'm gonna be honest, we've had a few rough patches and buffering periods here and there, but ultimately we've chosen a better router. I mean route, I mean root, wherever you're from, gosh I can't speak English. And today, I thought I would talk about some problems you may come across when you find your one true pairing. So yeah, let's get started. Problem number one. The biggest problem you will ever have is when you have to spend time apart from one another. For whatever reason, there will be times when you have to leave each other's side, and this will be the hardest part because without your bae by your side, you'll just feel lost without them. What you say? Mm, that you only meant well, well, cause you did. Mm, what you say? Mm, that it's all for the best, cause it is. Problem number two. Your bae knows that you are hot and irresistible and also knows that there will be others in the world who will want to connect with you. Even when you're in public and your bae isn't around to protect you. No matter how strong or tempting they may look do not engage with them girl to hold back this feeling for so long. Woo! Let's get it. last but not least the third problem looks at the complete opposite as you fall in love you will find your bae more and more irresistible and in many cases other people will find them irresistible too and will try to flirt with them so make sure you stand your ground and let them know that your bae is yours and no one else is to touch, okay? So I told my boyfriend I think his hair looks sexier pushed back in his Google Plus profile, but like, I don't know, do you think he looks sexier pushed back? Because I really Oh do. my god, your Wi-Fi is so strong. Can I get on your Wi-Fi? Can I tap that? That's my f***ing boyfriend, you bitch! <laughs> Y'all know I'm clearly kidding. I am not in a relationship with my Wi-Fi. I mean, well maybe I am. Are you in a relationship with your Wi-Fi because like, Seriously, I am taking this relationship to the next level. It is 100% commitment, although I have to pay a monthly bill to have them in a relationship with me, which I don't think is legal. I need to check out that. So I hope this video made you laugh or smile or anything because that's the only reason why I make videos is to make you guys smile. So yeah, if you liked it, give it a big thumbs up as it really helps a bitch out, so have a bitch out. And if you aren't subscribed or if your friends aren't subscribed, make sure you subscribe so that we can grow my channel and reach out to the world and make everyone laugh and smile and hmm. Also, make sure you go check out last week's video over there and yeah, stay fabulous, have a great week, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! We'd literally die, like hashtag dead without Wi-Fi. <gasps> I can't even.